Mr. DePap specifically targeted the Pelosi home to confront Speaker Pelosi. The man accused of bludgeoning U.S. House Speaker Nancy Pelosi's husband with a hammer after breaking into the couple's home was charged in California with attempted murder, assault with a deadly weapon and burglary, among other offenses. San Francisco District Attorney Brooke Jenkins outlined the charges against 42-year-old David DePape in a press conference on Monday detailing the brutal attack. He forced his way into the home through a rear glass door by breaking that glass. The defendant made his way upstairs to the second floor of the home, locating Mr. Pelosi in his bed sleeping. He woke him up, confronting him about the whereabouts of Speaker Pelosi. The 82-year-old speaker was in Washington at the time of the attack. Federal prosecutors say DePape allegedly intended to threaten to take her hostage and break her kneecaps if she lied under his questioning. Paul Pelosi told police he managed to slip away to a bathroom to call 911. The defendant, realizing that Mr. Pelosi had called 911, took Mr. Pelosi downstairs near the front door of the residence. When that door was opened, the defendant was holding his hammer which Mr. Pelosi appeared to be attempting to control by holding a portion of that hammer. The defendant then pulled the hammer away from Mr. Pelosi and violently struck him in the top of his head. Paul Pelosi, a real estate and venture capital executive who is also 82, has been hospitalized as he recovers from skull fractures and injuries to his hands and right arm. He is expected to make a full recovery according to Speaker Pelosi's office. An internet user with the same name as DePape expressed support for former President Donald Trump and the cult-like conspiracy theory QAnon in online posts. Federal prosecutors have also charged DePape with assault and attempted kidnapping.